What's up, gamers? So it's Gaming Addict, and uh, first off, I have to say is this Super Time Force game I didn't think would be that good, but I'm enjoying the hell out of this game. It, it's really fun. It's free, so if uh, any of you Xbox One gamers looking for something to play and you didn't download, I'd, I'd survive to go download. At first, I was pissed. Well, I'm still pissed that Xbox screwed us out of another month of games for gold. But I guess I'll overlook it. I'm still pissed, but I'll deal with it. But uh, back to the video. So uh, <laughs> I've been getting uh, some messages on Xbox Live asking why I'm not playing Destiny. And I mean, it's ridiculous. I have 48 friends on right now and 34 of them are playing Destiny. Wow, <laughs> like I woke up knowing I'd see a lot of Destiny, but actually looking at it, that is an absurd amount of people, which you know, people are like, well if a bunch of people are playing it, it's going to be good. No, it's not. I mean, I, I, my friend right now is level 13, and he, one night, one night he's level 13. So, and if I would have bought it, I would have been playing with him, so I would probably be anywhere from level 10 to 13. So you mean to, to tell me, I pick up Destiny, I play it for one night, and I'm already halfway to max level. Hell no. And I, I have a couple reasons I don't want to pick up Destiny. One thing is I just don't want, I don't really have the money at the moment. I had a, there's so many games coming out this year. I had to pick and choose it. I chose Master Chief Collection over Destiny. And I know a lot of you will be like, well, that's just because you're a, a Halo lover. Well, yeah, it's because I'm a Halo lover. <laughs> if, you, if you'd say it's because I'm a fanboy of Xbox, that's a little inaccurate. I do enjoy Halo. I have so many good memories from Halo 3. So many. It, I loved and thrived playing that game. And I cannot wait to play that. And I can make playlists for Halo 4 and put three maps in it. Like, I could play my favorite maps and that's all. My other reason is... I was considering buying Destiny a couple days ago, but then I read this shit from YouTube. That they're not letting Microsoft advertise. Well, people don't know if it's neither Sony or Activision or Bungie. Who cares? If Sony, Activision, or Bungie are going this low to make where my, one of the biggest contributors of gaming can't advertise, what makes you think that they're not gonna, they don't have more shit that they're not telling anyone about? And people are like, oh, they've already told about all Sony's exclusives and it's not that big of a deal. Well, let me ask you this question. If you was on the other side, would you tell people about, if you was on the other side trying to sell Destiny, would you tell Microsoft fans all the deals that's going on. No, it would hurt their sales. Obviously they wouldn't say anything like that if they had something planned like that until they knew that it was too late. Like maybe two months into launch. They've already made the, the, the beginning revenue from Destiny. And a lot of people don't know this, but a lot of money is made in the first two months of a game. You know, I wouldn't be surprised in two months, and I know it's not going to be like anything big, big, like the expansions. I wouldn't be surprised in two months if they're like, there is exclusive DLC, <coughs> exclusive DLC to add game modes, add new armor, add a class for nothing but Sony users for a certain amount of time. And people are like, but it's only timed exclusive. I'm not waiting a fucking year to get shit Sony already has. And people are like, but Microsoft has a bunch of time exclusives. They're, they don't have anything really important. And I know a lot of people are gonna be like, but they got Tomb Raider. Uh, a lot of people don't care about Tomb Raider. A lot of people do. That's all I really have to say about that. But you know, that's my reasons. A lot of people, and you know, I if I look on here and my friends are playing it and they tell me it's good and I see good reviews off YouTubers, not IGA, IGN, then I'll pick it up. But until then, I'm going to sit back and watch. But this is Gaming Addict, peace.